As y'all can see the back of my truck's a dead gum mess. I'm not a hoarder, but I'm an all season angler hunter, and I just end up with a lot of stuff back here. It ain't pretty to look at, but I've got you know kayak stuff, I've got camp chairs, I've got uh, cords, uh, you know, the, there's a workout bag from where I'm trying to get a little healthier. Uh, everything in here, you know, just just is, is difficult to get to. You see, I usually keep a gaff for getting stuff from, from way up at the front of the truck or a set of the, the, the tongs for getting stuff up there. So, you know, any solution to me would be good. And I, I thought about building one. I've looked at them, you know, but I'd be sure enough deep into the, the investment of building it plus the time of building it. Yeah, I ain't going to lie. For, for any of you that have watched me, watched any of my reviews, I shoot straight and I always will. You know, I've got an expensive option now. You see it back here on the trailer, the, the deck system. Um, I've been waiting on them to bring them things out for the Tacomas for a while. And just kind of toying around with the thoughts of, hey, yeah, I ought to do that. But, but it ain't cheap. I mean, it, it, beyond it ain't cheap, that sucker's freaking expensive. But... You know, I've seen them. I've seen them in action. I've got buddies with them that love them. They're they're outstanding for them. So I'm hoping for me that it's going to be a good option, and and we'll see. And and I'll I'll give you a, you know, after the honeymoon review, uh, we're gonna we're gonna clean this truck out today. We're gonna to try to put this sucker in. So y'all stay tuned. That's why you marry a short woman right there. <laughs> all right, got it laid all out behind me. Got the truck cleaned out. Y'all don't want to see a video of me putting this thing together because there are more professional and better videos out there of assembly. So I'm just going to tell you how it went after we're done. I like the way it's all laid out. I like the way it's marked. The instructions are straightforward. You don't want to hear me cuss about putting stuff together anyway. So I'm, I'm not a fun worker to work with. But we'll get it done, and I'll come back and talk to you about it, and we'll see what it looks like when it's all said and done. We're getting closer. But as you can see from the sweat and the mess, this hasn't been fun. I'm not going to say that, woohoo, this has been great. I got to admit, I have vastly underestimated it, but it's doable. So just me and you, hey, you know, Uncle Farrell again, this hasn't been a walk in the park. You have got to follow their instructions exactly. And if you think it sounds jacked up, read a little bit ahead and you'll figure out, no, they're right. Listen to what they say because it's easy to get lost in all this had it not been for my bride there's no telling where I'd be and I know I would have cussed a whole lot more so we're getting close uh, and, and I'm going to go ahead and put the drawers in then we'll come back later if you look at their website it says it's a no drill installation but in fine print it says except in some instances thanks Toyota appreciate that so that's been the only thing that I haven't liked about it so far but we're working on it we'll get it all put in and we'll show you some more about it all right, y'all, we got her done, and it, uh, I can't stress you enough, follow the instructions. The instructions actually say don't use power tools, but in the instructions it says we know you, and you're going to use power tools, so don't bow up on it. And they're right, I use power tools, but I did not bow up on it. I was very easy with them, so, so if you do it, pay attention to the instructions. I'm impressed with it so far. Let me grab this camera. You know, I, I mean, I've, I just shoved some stuff in here just for effect, rain gear, you know, and one of my axes and all. But, I mean, I can see this one being great for putting my, my kayak paddles, all sorts of stuff. It's got dividers. Um, I'm not sure what deck has. I'm sure that it looks like it's got a notch here so, so you can buy dividers for this, which might not be a bad thing to have, especially for, like, where my other one, I've got all my straps in, in a box, which fit, but I've got to be able to work, you know, with this stuff. And, and I know this is a mess, but... This is the way my truck usually looks, so I wanted to show you all that too. But uh, I mean, I'm impressed with it so far. You guys, I, I don't work in a donut factory, so I don't sugarcoat anything. I, I could say, woohoo, that was easy, this is great, la la. No, that's not me. You know, to me, this was, this was not a difficult, it wasn't undoable. I mean, we did it, and it was my bride and I, so it's, it's doable. Was it fun? No, it wasn't fun. The instructions, follow the instructions, do it. This thing's expensive. You know, but I already told you I was going to build something. So I would have to, to have the time to build it, the money to build it, my time. This was a good option for me. So I'll come back to you guys, let you know what I think about it. But you can see it, it, it's, it's going to take a lot of that stuff out of the way. I'll be using the ammo cans on the side. This is, 
this is where the straps will go. You see there's a lot of room on both sides. It's got good places. So that, that's a good place to put stuff that you need to get to regular like, like my kayak straps. So I'll have all that. And then, you know, this is going to be probably paddles and things. So I don't have my good paddles sitting out there in the way. You know, my other gear is going to go in there. I, I like the way this is. It's going to get a lot of that little stuff out of the way to where if I want to put my, my crates or my coolers or anything else on the top, I can do that. I just want to show you this, see what y'all thought, and, and see your options and, and thoughts on it. I'll come back later and do an after the honeymoon on it, so that's what I tend to do, but I, I, I want to kick the tires on it for a while. i got a big trip coming up, and we'll be using it there. So, hope this helped a little bit. This is the deck system in the Tacoma, and if y'all have any questions, holler at me.